I don't have to score the ball to make an impact in the basketball game. LeBron James' lifestyle and net worth. A famous basketball player, he started from being a great player to being one of the best in the world. He is the one and only LeBron James. Yes, you heard that right, LeBron James. We will talk about his net worth and how he spends his money. But before we get started, like this video and subscribe to my channel. Trophy of the 2012 NBA Finals. Let's get to know him first. LeBron James was born on December 30th, 1984 in Akron, Ohio in the United States. He is an American professional basketball player who is widely considered one of the greatest all-around players of all time and who won NBA championships with the Miami Heat in 2012 and 2013, the Cleveland Cavaliers in 2016, and the Los Angeles Lakers in 2020. According to Forbes, he was the fifth highest paid athlete in 2020, as his annual earnings are estimated to be $88.2 million. Moreover, throughout his extraordinary career, James is estimated to have accumulated a net worth of $500 million. Four years ago, <laughs> which is not too long ago, you know. Uh... Early career. James was introduced into basketball when he was nine years old. James began playing unorganized basketball in the fifth grade. He later played amateur athletic union basketball for the Northeast Ohio Shooting Stars. The team enjoyed success at a local and national level led by James and his friends C.M. Cotton, Drew Joyce III, and Willie McGee. The group dubbed themselves the Fab Four and promised each other that they would attend high school together. In a mood that stirred local controversy, they chose to attend St. Vincent St. Mary High School, a private Catholic school predominantly with white students where they also played basketball. It was in this team where LeBron was spotted by scouts and featured to play for the Cavaliers in 2003 as the first overall draft pick. Named the 2003-2004 NBA Rookie of the Year, he soon established himself as one of the league's premier players, winning the NBA MVP award in 2009 and 2010. At the end of the 2009-10 season, James became arguably the most sought-after free agent in NBA history when his contract with the Cavaliers expired. James announced that he was signing with the Heat. In the 2011-2012 season, James averaged 27.1 points per game and won his third MVP award while helping Miami advance to its second consecutive NBA Finals appearance. He had arguably his greatest individual season in 2012-2013 as he averaged 26.8 points, 7.3 assists, and a career-high 8 rebounds per game. James also helped Miami win 27 consecutive games that season, the second longest such streak in NBA history. And he was rewarded with his fourth league MVP award. In 2016-2017, James had arguably his best regular season by setting career highs with averages of 8.7 assists and 8.6 rebounds per game, while still scoring 26.4 points per game. He sustained his excellence in the Eastern Conference playoffs, scoring 32.5 points per game. James, a free agent, joined the Los Angeles Lakers. He continued to play at a high level, averaging 27.4 points, 8.5 rebounds, and 8.3 assists per game. But he missed significant playing time because of an injury, a strained groin, for the first time in his career. The Lakers struggled in his absence and ultimately finished the 2018-2019 season with a 37-45 record, ending James' personal playoff streak at 13 seasons. I commit to the game. I put myself, my body, and my mind in position to be available to my teammates. Salary of LeBron James. During his first 10 seasons in the NBA, LeBron James earned just over $126 million in salary alone. That's $452 million from his first decade as a professional. As of this writing, LeBron has earned slightly over $600 million in salaries during his career, before taxes and expenses. His first contract paid $18.8 million over four years. 
He signed a three-year, $60 million extension with the Cavs before the 2007-2008 season that upped his annual salary from $5.8 million to $13 million, $14.4 million, and finally $15.8 million for the 2009-2010 season. Heading into the 2011 season, LeBron infamously announced his intention to leave Cleveland for Miami with a televised special called The Decision. He recently launched his own media company to give black content creators a platform to showcase their work. In addition, he turned the oft-criticized The Decision into a $3 million donation to help the Boys and Girls Club. When LeBron moved to Miami, he took a lower than market rate of $110 million over six years. In his first season with the Heat, he actually earned $1.2 million less than what he was making in Miami. In 2016, fresh off winning the NBA championship, LeBron signed a three-year $100 million deal with the Cavs. In the first year, he made $23 million. In the second year, he made $30.963 million which also made him the highest paid player in the league for the first time in his career. In the third year of the deal, he made a league leading $33.285 million. Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there with the world's smallest violin. Cause this is what I hear when you talk. Endorsement deals. LeBron earned an estimated $326 million from endorsement deals with dozens of companies including McDonald's, Microsoft, State Farm, Beats by Dre, Coca-Cola, Dunkin' Donuts, Baskin Robbins, Samsung, Nike, and more. In addition to endorsing Beats by Dre, he earned royalty payments totaling $1 million during his years as a spokesman for the company and when it was sold to Apple for $3 billion, his court was an astonishing $30 million. Don't wait on me. I'm ready. Nike deal. LeBron also signed his first Nike endorsement deal at the age of 18. The deal paid $90 million over seven years, $12.8 million per year. He actually was offered $115 million to sign with Reebok. In December 2015, LeBron signed a lifetime endorsement deal with Nike that ultimately could be worth more than $1 billion. Today, LeBron earns a whopping $20 million per year from Nike. LeBron James, LeBron James, LeBron James is the best high school basketball player I have ever seen. Movies. LeBron has appeared in several movies, mostly as himself. It includes the 2008 movie More Than a Game, the story of SpongeBob SquarePants in 2009, Trey Arch in 2015 and Smallfoot in 2018, in which he was the voice for Gwenge. Can't deny that, we have to accept it, that he does what he does better than us, and he does what we do better than Other investments. LeBron James has made several big investments with the millions he has earned. However, his business deals off the court have also made him incredibly wealthy. From his lucrative lifelong contract with Nike, to his investments in Beats Electronics, Blaze Pizza, and Liverpool FC, the 16-time All-Star boasts an impressive financial portfolio. LeBron James, a 28.9 rebound, eight assist night. <laughs> Spring Hill Entertainment. Spring Hill Entertainment is a production company co-founded by LeBron and his business partner, Maverick Carter. Springfield Entertainment has produced several movies, documentaries, and television shows. They're on the job. Yeah, I'm learning. I'm shadowing. Blaze Pizza. Blaze Pizza was just a pizza startup when it became LeBron's choice of investment in 2012. LeBron believed so much in Blaze Pizza that he turned down a $15 million extension offer from McDonald's and went all in with Blaze Pizza. As of 2020, LeBron owns an equity stake at the company, which is approximately worth $40 million. And uh, being available to him um, and, and being the best player on the floor every night. Liverpool FC. While it is LeBron's ultimate goal to own an NBA team, in the meantime, he'll have to make do with owning a soccer team. In 2011, LeBron stuck a deal to acquire a 2% stake in Liverpool FC from the club's majority owners, the Fenway Sports Group, owners of the Red Sox. In the years since the deal was struck, Liverpool won the UEFA Championship League tournament 
and has grown to be worth $2 billion. LeBron's stake is worth at least $40 million. I put myself, my body, and my mind in position to be available to my teammates. Luxurious things owned by LeBron James. His new mansion in LA is one of the latest acquisitions. The mansion sits on approximately 16,000 square feet of space, and it would take days to spot the difference between indoor and outdoor luxury. The boomerang-shaped infinity pool will be the first attractive feature to wake you from deep slumber. The mansion has a spa and a sauna, as you may know athletes need good body therapy. Such amenities are uncompromisable in this case. A hydro tub, a float tank, and a massive bonfire pit are also some of the exterior features. The mansion has eight bedrooms, a huge walk-in closet, 11 bathrooms, and a private patio. Apart from his LA home, James also owns another property in Brentwood, a $23 million mansion. The 11 bathroom and six bedroom property is still registered in his name. We can't be beat and that led us all the way to, it's crazy playing into high school. Car collection. LeBron James is not strange to acquiring costly things. He's synonymous with spending severely. When it comes to buying cars, his fleet of cars includes some of the best with Porsche Turbo, Hummer H2, Dodge Challenger among his prized assets. I don't know, RJ. I really don't know, man. I don't know if everything is okay, man. I think, uh... Wristwatches. He is also notorious for purchasing unfathomably expensive wristwatches. He owns a number of Rolex timepieces, with some costing as much as $100,000. Um, I don't, and I don't sit around thinking about it or crying about it, whatever the case may be. Um, I just try to come in the next season and... LeBron James' current contract, 2021. According to SportTrack, LeBron James' current contract was signed in 2018 with the Los Angeles Lakers for a period of four years, which is worth $153,312,846, including $153,312,846 guaranteed and an annual average salary of $38,328,212. Moreover, James signed a two-year max extension with the Lakers in 2021 that will keep him at the franchise till 2023. He signed a massive $85 million contract that will come into effect from the 2021-2022 season. This is all about the richest basketball player. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to press the notification bell icon for more interesting videos. Till then, goodbye.